A wise girl knows her limits. A smart girl knows that she has none, said Marilyn Monroe, who was an American actress, model, and singer. Wise girl knows her limits. Limits means nam the Kannada nelli kelter Lakshman Rega bitta atta dubu. That is the limit. Limit means when you should speak, to whom to speak, how you should act, what is the limit. All those things were taught as a Sanskrit, as a, as a culture. So that you understand and you know, not because they wanted to slave you, our ancestors, our seniors, are so beautiful. They kept, they taught us every part of our body to have a limit. And the children in India, in Karnataka knows how, in what volume they should talk to the seniors, to the parents, to the gurus. Yes. How to fold their hands how to do now Sashtanga Namskara? How to even serve? How to smile when and when not? What dress to go to what occasion? Yes. Those were the limits of the culture, what Marilyn Monroe was telling. A wise girl knows her limits. Once you know the limits, then whatever, wherever you go, you are respected. But Marilyn Monroe says, a wise girl knows her limits, a smart girl knows that she has none. And all the girls started stripping and running because Marilyn Monroe said, none, don't follow any script. No, 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 she never said that. She's a very fantastic lady who has seen several high profile men who was controlling the world, been with them, slept with them, married them, whatever you can call it. For our eyes, from our Indian eyes, it is all dirt because we kept our limits. For her, it is just an expression to know the world. So when her physical body was exposed, everybody thought she was a dirty girl from our Indian view. But for, for the Western view, it was an accepted fact allowing the freedom to express. So Marilyn Monroe said, a smart girl knows that she has none. But first she said, she knows, a wise girl knows the limit. Wise girl knows, but she must come out from that idiot box. She must you come out from that Lakshman Rekha. Yes, to cross the Lakshman Rekha, you have to first know 100 is 100 years Sanskrit. You practice and make your body so strong. You don't fear about the limits. You can just break any limits because you know, wherever you go, you know to come back to the same point. Yes. Wherever the kite flies so high, you know, you can come back to the roots. Whenever you go to a restaurant, you know that when you pull the chair, you can, you know, to keep it back. You are conscious. At the same time, you can laugh and jump and dance and scream. At the end, you know, it is back to your foundation. That's what Marilyn Monroe said. A wise girl knows her limits. Yes, everybody should know the, know the limit. And you should be wise. But that is only up to your 12th year or your 18th year. Once you're out of your house, a smart, you become a smart girl. You don't not have to know your limits. A smart girl knows that she has none, no limits for her. Limits means... She can talk to anybody, no limits, because she knows her samskriti. She's wise and she knows her limits. So you can go and when you do not practice your limits, when you go to smile to somebody else, then you will be trapped. Hence, there was a limit. I was in the Tokyo guest house. And the guest house is in a room, there will be one, two, one, two, oh, three, three quarts of two uh, tire, lower tire and upper tire. And it's a mixed one. 
like some we had co-ed schools and the girls and the boys studying in the same school. But here in guest house, grown-up children in a guest house, in a hotel, staying in the same room. Six people in a room, yes. And there was this Japanese girl, very, very pretty Japanese girl, always walking inside. And there, there was a technique of the Japanese uh, immigration department to find out what the foreigners are doing. She'll come, she'll make friendly with everybody. Everybody is in love with her because well-dressed, because to get well-dressed is very difficult when, as a foreigner, when you go to Tokyo, it's very expensive. So for us, even to dress ourselves is very difficult. Then for us to see a girl well-dressed, yes, and so pretty, she'll talk to anybody, but she knows her limits. <laughs> Most of the boys go to her, make friendship, yes. Night time, even they come to her bed. I'm, I was I was sleeping on the lo lower one and she was on the top one. Night time, an Australian boy went to her and they were chit-chatting at 12 o'clock. I, I was telling him, look, you are talking, I have to sleep. <laughs> then they both slept together. In between, she got up and stop, stop, stop. <laughs> she said, you are my friend, <laughs> not my lover. She's telling you are my friend, not my lover. You can sit with me, you can sleep with me. But don't do other things. <laughs> that is the limit Marilyn Monroe was teaching the whole world. A wise girl knows her limits. She can, so what? She can talk, she can jump, she can move, she's strong. Yes. <laughs> when um, the greatest martial artist, Sosai Masuayama's daughter was sent to Singapore, the youngest daughter, and uh, the Singapore chairman, Peter Chong, was trying to tell her, please practice your father is a rich, strong man, strongest man in the world. You must also practice karate. And she said, I don't have to practice karate. I won't practice karate. And Peter Chong told her, look, if somebody attacks you, you need to defend. So you practice karate. She said, no, my father is already strong, so I don't have to practice. I will not practice. If somebody attacks you, she said, if somebody attacks me, I'll smile at them. <laughs> she knows her limits. She knows her strength. So she knows she can smile, nobody can rape her, nobody can miss you. So that was the limit. Yes. So everybody practice your Sanskriti, make yourself very strong. Then, yes, Marilyn Monroe said, wise girl knows her limits. A smart girl knows that she has none. You should have none. Anything and everything, you should come out of your comfort zone and experience it. Come out of a comfort zone experience. Little bruise is not a problem. You are scared what people think about you. Don't worry about what they think. Yes. They will follow you once you show your guts. <laughs>